If you drive into Quinter, Kansas and ask anyone, where's Waldo? They'll tell you, at work, of course. Coming in? Every day. I come in here and I turn on my light. Ralph Waldo McBurney goes to work at his honey business. Unfortunately, summer is bee season, and during our visit, things weren't exactly buzzing around here. But the mere fact that he shows up at all earns him the title America's oldest worker, an honor recently bestowed on him at a ceremony in Washington. Waldo is 104. This is the one you just got? Yes. And with a driver's license to prove it. This doesn't expire until 2010. The license may last longer than I do. Don't count on it. Yeah, here we are. Ralph Waldo McBurney has already outlived even his gravestone's expectations. Now what are you going to do? I'm just going to let somebody else worry about that. <laughs> Waldo says he's here today because he never smoked or drank and always ate his vegetables. But even more imperative. Yeah, it's very important. I have a theory, and that theory is that, uh, oh, this. What, what is it? <laughs> While we're waiting. <laughs> Something slips my mind, it'll come back in five minutes. Let me tell you about Waldo's book. It's a self-published autobiography called My First Hundred Years. During the off season for Honey, he keeps busy signing every single copy and mailing every single order, which isn't easy. Heck, when you're 104, sometimes getting off the porch isn't easy. <sighs> But Waldo insists on staying active, basically because it beats the alternative, hiring a stonemason. Or as Waldo finally put it, You said you had a theory. <laughs> Do you remember the theory? Use it or lose it. Use it or lose it. Hey, I never said he was Ralph Waldo Emerson. Yes, it is. Very important. Uh, we, we if you want to know how to get his book, or if you just want to hear more from Waldo's interview, we've got it right now on our website. What a wonderful man. I loved him. Yeah. I've interviewed a lot of people over 100. He is the most with it I've ever talked to. And does he have any family? Yes, he does. He's got kids, and he's on his, his second wife. Had the first one 30 years, this one 44. Wow. Yeah. And who knows? He may have a third. Anything could happen, right? <laughs> he says he's done. Yeah, he's done. I was going to say, that's probably not a very nice thing to say.